Hello, hello, ladies and girls. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another episode of PC Building Simulator. Okay, so we got our parts, and uh, I mean, let's let's do Scotty Beast PC here first. Because I mean, removing viruses pretty darn easy. And we will have it out on the way there. Alright. Wire scanner. Almost. There we go. Alright. Get back up, will you? There we go. Hold on. Been a while since we had a a virus in computer, like only viruses. Alright, let's collect. He's just giving us five star, no comment. No comment about it. Alright, so We have two cases. This is the one with the glass panel, right? Oh yeah. I'm pretty sure that was the one with the duels and this is the space stuff okay so let's see what do we have Alright, and we need a 1300x. And some cooling paste. Alright, let's put some memory in that baby. And we also need to put a storage right in there. Looks like it will be this too. Day what I was thinking with this, uh, but maybe the normal 980 because the Aliyah had more of, so they're probably for the SLI build. Uh, 
power supply. need to do any other cables like this but <laughs> I sort of feel like I have to just because I can even though I know that I'm not gonna be visible at all Alright, now it just tells me it's an incomplete case. Alright, now I just need my USB. And let's try and boot that baby up. Alright, let's remove the glass panel here while we wait. Okay. Ready, come on. Um, install 3D Mark. And just in case, I want to install GPU Tuner. Just in case it doesn't reach it, uh, I can probably overclock a little bit. And OCCT. Okay, come on now. There we go. Might as well put this in. There we go. Okay, let's do a run, see what we get. And now I want the motherboard, the MSI Carbon. And here it looks like the, it's these two. And these two. And there we go. And that ugly SLI bridge. Uh, I'm not quite over that. Oh, I guess that's just the... The stationary one. One to move. Um. Oh, it will. Hmm. My bad. <laughs> okay. So, we need... CPU and memory. I feel like I might be cutting this a bit close. Fifty bucks remaining, and I think the cooler was fifteen bucks. Wow, that's probably the closest one I did so far. Ah, sure was. <laughs>
but I do believe I got everything in here. And I'm pretty darn sure this is going to work out great. Okay, now it just tells me an incomplete case. Uh, which is very true, because there's no side panels on it. Four thousand seven hundred and seventy-two. Awesome. And put the back panel back on. And the front. And we did it for under a thousand bucks. Well, if that did that well, and got uh, 4,700, and this one should be able to hit the mark. Uh, well, only one way to find out, right? Let's see. Uh, I didn't have any more jobs for right now. That one has expired. Alright, do a collect, and that was good, five stars. Alright, so. Let's just get 3D Mark installed here, see what we get and kind of roll with it. Mm. There we go. And run. Good, good. Oh, it's already a red LED. Pretty darn nice. Alright, so... Uh, that one I can't do. Planet of Tanks. Okay. Short batter. Need something fixed. Okay, a hundred and fifty. Let's see, what is a thirteen hundred X? A hundred and fifty. Nice. You got it. Does he even say anything here? He makes repairs. Can you have a look at it for me? I don't. I have no idea what's wrong. It just won't turn on. I heard of AMD. They're meant to be pretty good. I heard you guys use the use part here, please don't do that. So yeah, 
since he is mentioning AMD, then it should be the processor. Although they do do graphics cards too. But in that case they would probably say something like MSI or something, something, something. Okay, another diagnosing fix for 150 bucks. And that one too has a 1300x, so it's probably the same. New PC needed. That can do players unknown battlegrounds, unrecommended specs. There we go. And recommended, not recommended 4K. Alright, so we're gonna go Intel for this one, so it's an i5-6500. And... Uh, Let's see, that's 165. I kinda wanna get up the generation. Even though it is like 15 bucks more. Because I feel like we get more choices that way. Right, let's see. Well, we need to keep it a little on the cheap side, so let's go for that uh, gigabyte card. Alright, and um, 8 gigs of memory. And we need a 1070. Okay. Basic storage, and um, let's go for the EVGA again because I like it, I really do, and it has good, good value. Also, we need a cooler. Uh, let's just go for basic one. We're not gonna do any overclocking here, and. Um, Let's here go for a cheap case. Okay, so that should actually do it. Uh, Sean components are close to the bomb. Um, I don't think I got any Sean here, right? Okay, so let's change out that memory, because I know we can get Sean that way. And it is the same price, so it doesn't really matter. Then at least you get one component, and I think that is enough to make him happy. You won't believe the prices. Uh, 
a Ryzen 5 quad core 1400 and an MSI GeForce GTX 1060 Gaming X 6, 6 gig. That's actually not bad. Well, let's just dismiss, dismiss that, and we unlock the new 1080. Still need to get that 7700K though. <laughs> we got over 7,000. Heck yeah, that's how we're doing it, boy. <laughs> Alright, let's click the buy button and collect our money. I'm really happy with the new PC. Lovely. Really lovely. Alright. And with that, I think we're gonna end off this episode. Hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you all in the next one. Until then, bye bye.